Yesterday, America's space program took another historic leap for humankind. Today, the New Horizons team is bringing what was previously a blurred point of light into focus. I'd like to take you on a short tour to frame the discussion, and I'm not going to say a whole lot. Uh, the first image that I'd like to bring up uh, was taken just about two hours ago by the Solar Dynamics Observatory. I hope you recognize that object, and I think you, I think you know where we're going. Mercury from the Messenger mission, Venus from Magellan. If anybody doesn't recognize the next planet, I'd like you to leave the auditorium. <laughs> APL security will escort you to Area 51. <laughs> the red planet Mars. I had to get a Hubble image in there somewhere. Uh, I realize I, I missed Ceres, which the Dawn spacecraft is orbiting right now, Jupiter with some of the Jovian moons in shadow uh, from the Galileo spacecraft, Cassini at Saturn. What a wonderful mission. Uh, this is just a striking image. Uranus, uh, somebody made a wisecrack that I put it in sideways. <laughs> Neptune, and for a grand finale, I turn it over to Alan Stern, the principal investigator of the Pluto New Horizons mission. Now, all of our news today uh, relates to the surfaces of uh, Pluto and its satellites. Um, we'll, we'll be talking more about the surfaces uh, in the press event on Friday down at NASA headquarters but we'll also be bringing in uh, atmospheric results at that point. Thank you, Will. And so it, Sharon just blew our socks off when we had the new image today. So if we can pull it up so you can it's take there. a look at it. I don't, yeah. 